when he made the first film, I was hearing about it. He had so much problem to have finance. So it was many years later, I think it was uh, end of 1950 or so, when he approached me for the first time and said, the film is complete. And he told me all the struggle that he went through and he would very much like me to do the music for it. I, I was, of course, very happy and I said, can we see the rushes? And we saw the rushes in a, in a hot summer afternoon, I think, in a very uncomfortable situation, old cinema, Bhavani. I tell you, it was such a surprise for me because I never knew anything about his making films, which he has never done before. And I was completely, you know, pulled over. Even seeing a rough rush, the effect was so strong, and I immediately got a tune which I thought would be ideal for the theme music. And I sang it for him. La da da, la da di, la da da di, la da da, la da da. He was offered everywhere. Even uh, I was in Los Angeles. All of a sudden, I received a phone from him. He's in Los Angeles. In Bombay, Madras, he was invited with fabulous sums at his disposal to make a film, whatever he wants. But somehow, he was very honest about it. He said he would do it in Bengal because he is more familiar with the culture there, with the everything, the background. He was so much respected and loved, like a film star, you know. So as far as Calcutta is concerned or Bengal, he, he was absolutely a hero for the last 30 years of his life. He came to all my programs, my star recitals, and we used to talk for hours sometime, you know, just Oh, remember that scene of that film or that Bergman's or Rossellini's or this? He had so much knowledge about the Western culture on the whole. He was like an encyclopedia. He had very good idea of music. He was not a practicing musician or performing, but he did have training and he trained himself. He was all the time hearing records of opera, Western music. He knew Bach, Beethoven, Mozart, Haydn, Handel. It was something like 9 or 10 o'clock in the night that we started recording and finished around 4. It took us about 6 to 7 hours to do the whole film, Pater Panchali. I remember we never had to do like three, four takes or anything like that. Maybe once or twice we made more than one take. Always it was first or second take. particular scene which was very strong. I just used a tar shanai, a board instrument with a, an added little pickup.
The last time I saw him was in that apartment in Calcutta. And I went and uh, we had about, I stayed about little less than an hour. He was really suffering for quite a long period, off and on. But even then, he was having so many ideas. And that was the last time I remember. <laughs>